So in this month's calendar image, we have a patient with a choroidal melanoma. You can see on the color image that there is an elevated lesion obscuring the view of the optic nerve. Um, this is confirmed on the ultrasound, which shows the collar button shape of the tumor. And the fluorescein androgram shows a double circulation of the melanoma, which is consistent with this diagnosis. Choroidal melanomas are the second most common type of intraocular tumor and they're important to diagnose and treat in a timely manner because they can metastasize to other parts of your body, such as the liver or the lungs, which can be fatal. They're still overall quite rare. They occur in about five to six million people in the general population. And small to medium-sized melanomas can usually be treated successfully with something called plaque brachytherapy, which is a type of radiation. Large tumors may sometimes require removal of the eye. With recent advances, we're also able to do what's called gene expression profiling, which assesses the aggressiveness of the tumor and the likelihood that it will metastasize over the course of five or 10 years.